Hey everyone, QB King 77 here from the Android Creative Syndicate team here to do a video showing you how to factory restore your phone and uh, reprovision your phone. What uh, what the process I'm going to do is it's going to factory restore your phone to how it was out of the box and also force a hands-free activation which will reprovision your phone. Uh, the only reason I would say to do this is if your phone's causing you problems. Any problems if it's freezing, locking up, rebooting randomly, then I would recommend doing this. Uh, the reason why I'm going to do this is because my phone froze a couple times today and um, someone told me that uh, doing this is going to help fix that and completely remedy it. So in case you're getting phone freezes, any of that stuff having issues with your phone or you just want to do a factory reset and reprovision your phone, then go ahead and follow this. But you will initially need to start and get your MSL code. I'll post a link in the description of the video on how to get your MSL code. Um, I do have a video showing you how to do that, so you can just go ahead and watch that and get your MSL code. And once you have your MSL code, go ahead and go to the dialer and just type pound pound 786 and then pound. And now uh, it says RTN at the top, just hit reset. And then you're going to need to enter your MSL number. So I'm going to go ahead and enter my MSL number in real quick. One second, don't want uh, you guys to see I think it's a sensitive number, so I'm going to go ahead and enter it. Hit OK, and then it says reset the phone to manufacturer's default. It's asking, so just a heads up that this will not wipe any data on your internal uh, storage, basically your SD card. It's not going to wipe anything on your internal SD card. No pictures, no music, anything you put on there, but it will wipe your phone's data, such as apps, contacts, messages, things of that nature. So make sure you back any of those up that you do need before you do this process. So I'm just going to go ahead and hit yes, reset the phone to manufacturer's default. Um, takes up the screen, still says RTN at the top. Hasn't done anything yet. It says uh, RTN reset success. Mm -hmm. So it went ahead and powered off my phone and I'm, it, I'm sure it might go into stock Android recovery and then uh, reflash the stock ROM. Okay, so my phone did reboot. Um, I'm not too sure that there it goes. It did go into stock Android recovery. As you can see, it says wiping data. And it says updating applications. And uh, now that it's done, looks like my phone's gonna go ahead and reset. Reboot again, and I'm sure once it boots up, I will be back completely stock how I was out of the box. As you can see, stock boot animation. My, my phone, I'm, I should have mentioned, my phone was completely on stock when I did do this. I'm not too sure what's gonna, what would happen if you were rooted and you tried doing this. So do that at your own risk if you do want to do that. But this is for if you are on stock and you're having issues on stock. All right, now that my phone has booted back up, it, might, it should actually uh, run the hands-free activation again. As you can see, it says hands-free activation. Welcome to Sprint. We're now activating your device. So your device is going to be reprovisioned. And then you'll be good to go. It says congratulations, device has been activated. Press OK to continue. So press the OK button. Then it's going to check for a PRL update. It says PRL has been updated. Press OK to continue. So hit OK. Now it's going to check for a firmware update. It says please wait. It says no firmware update is available. Just hit OK. And now it says device will reboot. Just hit OK. And your phone's going to reboot. And once it's booted back up, then you know your device is uh, completely factory reset and reprovisioned, and you're good to go. So uh, yeah, that's how you factory reset your phone and reprovision it. If you do run into any problems, have any questions, feel free to ask, leave a comment, send me a message. I'll be happy to help you guys out. You can follow me on Twitter at QBKing77. All links are going to be in the description of the video. Feel free to subscribe to me as well for future how-to videos. And as always, thanks for watching. Hope you guys like the video.